we have Dmitry Drakin and Sam Shackland here with us who just drew the Grand Prix game here at the Grand Prix in Belgrade. Um, Dmitry, do you want to start? What is your okay. Uh, game? Today I don't have uh, fighting moons and prefer a line in Grunfeld without risky. But okay, my computer says uh, what have a little bit a uh, little bit advantage, but I don't know how to realize it. Maybe Sam uh, make some strong moves, Queen D6, for example. My computer says no about 0 20 for white, but okay, really it's absolutely a quiet position. And it's a boring game. Yeah. Okay. It was Sam, was it a boring game or is Dmitry's computer a bit outdated? <laughs> no, I mean, there's no doubt this position is a little bit more comfortable to play for on the white side. I think objectively black is absolutely fine, but um, I just sort of think the worst thing that could like possibly happen to white if absolutely everything goes wrong is he loses his a2 pawn, he trades all the queens, all the rooks, and still makes a draw, and the worst thing that happens to black is the queen comes to h6 and you get checkmated. So it definitely feels like even though uh, black is a pawn up, you have to be at least a little bit careful, but I had come up with this plan to play a5 and queen d6, because when I play a5 I have provoked white's rook to the c1 square, so he does not have queen c1, and when my queen is on d6 he does not have queen d2, and as long as this queen can't come to h6, I think. I mean, it's a little bit uncomfortable, but uh, I can't see myself losing this position with 90 minutes on the clock. Maybe in a rapid game I could, but with 90 minutes, okay, you're a little worse, but it's hard, so hard to imagine losing. Well, both of you now mentioned this, uh, and, and not, not just now, but um, everyone is talking about the computer and the engine and this minimal advantage of 0 0.25, 0 0.30. At, at your level, does that advantage make any sense? Is it is it realistic to be able to use that advantage, or I is it not? Is it so just not important. important. No. So, because a lot of people rely on these analyses where the computer says says this or zero thirty or zero point five, and they think that when they judge oh. a position, they say, okay, white is better because the computer says zero point five. But so, is your advice to people not to trust the computer that much in that respect, or how should we, those of us who are not at your level, go about? trusting those uh, small advantages the computer gives? Well, it depends on the position, like 0 0.25, 0 0.30 can come in completely different ways, like this one where it's opposite bishops is one thing, like you know, typical 0 0.30 where you have isolated pawn on d5 and no great way to attack it, like that's going to be pleasantly better for white, you can have some 0 0.30 and bishop g5 knight orf and have absolutely no clue what's going on, and it's just totally irrational position, so it just I mean, the computer is a useful tool to have for these kinds of things, but if you're not, like, reasonably strong yourself and thinking yourself, it's entirely useless you need to be putting in your own brain as well or else you just become a monkey pressing buttons. Dmitry? What no, for me, evolution is absolutely not important. I prefer a comfortable position, yes, and the computer says away. It is very important, but okay, practically, uh, evolution it is... It doesn't really no, ma play much. All right, after three rounds, how, uh, how are you satisfied with, with your performance so far? Uh, Sam, you want to start us off there? Well, I have a lot more points than I deserve. Um, I had a horrible opening disaster both with Becro and Gristrick, and somehow managed a point and a half for two in these games when I think I was essentially lost in both games at some point. So I'm not happy with the quality of my play, but I'm certainly very happy with the amount of points I have given uh, how I have been playing so far. But, you know, two out of three with two blacks to start the tournament is certainly quite fine. Which is, which is, sorry, I just need to jump in here. Which is, let's say, better, quote unquote, to play bad and win or to play good and lose? Of course, to play badly and win, but uh, I mean, winning is the most important thing, but ideally you will play well and win. I don't know. I, no, mean, I didn't play very well in either of my previous two games. Thank you. Okay, I think in the first two rounds I was okay, but today my energy are low and okay, I will try in next rounds. Improve. Well, thank you both very much and good luck with the next rounds.